this is the transformer generations the fourth cybertron deluxe class optimus prime so before i begin um we put that aside we take a quick look at the packaging there is the autobot symbol right there optimus prime says four of cybertron if you can see it let me zoom out a bit no 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 zoom out i say thank you so the vehicle mode, Optimus Prime, and um, so here you have more Optimus Prime pictures there. And on the here, in case you forget his names, there's Optimus Prime. And on the back, you got the pictures and everything and stuff. So, um, you got the bio if you wanna read it. There you go. And there you go. So. Let me increase my lighting here. This is too dark here, so. There is um oh Timos Prime right there. And there is the vehicle mode. And it says here, Cybertronian Trap Mode and Iron Cannon included. There you go. So that basically it. So there you go. Pretty much to the backing. So here is the figure himself, and and just on the side note, um, well, um, I have been um busy day, and I have nothing to review, so so I have been hiatus for a couple of weeks, not not weeks, I lost count, but still I'm back now, and yeah, because I do not have time to review things now, so but just a second, wait a second. Forgot to show you one thing. Um, the um picture right there. There you go. And that basically. Sorry, but keep following stuff. Anyway, thank you. So on to the figure himself. Now, um, here is the um Optimus Prime, the four Cybertron, the game version of Optimus Prime. It's okay. And as, has, as all of you know, this figure has gotten smaller. Yeah, Hasbro has gotten smaller and smaller and smaller. Yes, but, but still, it's a good figure. And just a little size comparison. Here it is with the Transform Prime View Jack. The Deluxe Class View Jack, Jackie. And there you go. And they are about the same size. So, pretty small. There you go. And yeah, that basically. And he have he comes with with his um in the indicative bl of blaster. His what I like to call it the path blaster, which I I always use this blaster in the game. So yeah, it's because because I play the game. So yeah, very nice motor detail, overall, very cool. You know, basically um they got two parts here. They got two handle here, which this one is for the vehicle mode and this one is for the robot mode. So. And you know the blaster it just plugs into the, to the hand here, just just like that, like that so you can hold it. So that basically is so we'll, up. We'll put him aside. So on to the figure. Quick look at the head scope. Very nice head scope. Very primey looking. Very cool. And um yeah he got a nice Autobot symbol on both sides here. He got very nice um arms here, the legs, whatever very well, but it's simplistic, but it's okay, it's, it's still cool, I mean, this figure is still nice, it's still incredible, but it, the transformation, a lot of people complain, yeah, it's very simple, yes, but I don't, I, I actually, I don't mind, because um, transformer, transformation simplistic, that, that just make this figure more, you know, relaxing, so, I, I, I like that personally, so, um, for articulation, um, his um, head is on a ball joint. You can go all, get, go all the range of motion as you want. Um, he, his shoulder is on a um, ball joint. You can go kind of in and out, but it's very limited just because due to his bulk of this section right here. But he can go all the way around. And he got a uh, bicep swivel, a elbow joint, very nice elbow joint, kind of like double joint elbow. He got a wrist that can go all the way around. There you go. 
and he got a waste, so well, that's really nice on the ball drawing, so you can get a like app crunch, kind of, I don't know. A hip sits on the ball drawing, go in and out, front and back, um, bend at the knee, very nice knee, very nice knee, just due to transformation. <laughs> but, and he got a ankle that go ball drawing, so you can go pivot, like a nice pivot, but not so much, but you know, enough, you know, up and down. And that basically all you get for articulation. Not, not very good articulation, but it's okay. I mean, it's just enough for a normal toy. So, yeah, very cool figure. I I personally like it. So, so to transform him. So first thing, what you gonna do? You're gonna come right here to the feet. You wanna un untap it from. You know, unsnap it from the fit here. Just bring it up and flush against his chin, shin here, like that. Just push it forward like that. Like that, and then you like that. Like so. And then what you're gonna do, you're gonna join the feet together. They got a um, few pegs right here and few poles right here. The two port there. You just align with it and you join your feet together like that and then what you're gonna do you want to take these smokestacks here bring them up like so just raise them up or if you want you can only can mount the gun here where I want to do with it anyway keep that aside I always forget things anyway but you gotta rotate at the fist like this like that so then you want to Rotate at the bicep here, and you wanna fold it like that. And then what you're gonna do? You're gonna take this part right here, this section right here. You um you rotate it like that, and you tap it in. They're gonna form the grill of the of the Cybertronian truck mode. There, there. And yeah, there you go. That is basically it. So second verse is same as the first. So. You rotate the fist, you rotate at the bicep until the grill section is facing you and you want to bring this up, the wheel wells there and the fist, bring it up and you take the grill section, rotate it and then you, until you can pack them in like that. Then what you're gonna do, you're gonna come right out to the back, You unpack this back section and then even try to mold the um the four wheels and stuff that the game has so that, that, uh, 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 at least they did that so that's really cool so you just want to bring the um head down like that so just bring the head down and you will follow by the arms so just like that and just bring it down like so you cover up the gap right there and you bring it forward again and you see here you see here um, there was a um, a, a little poster and a tap here if you can see that here take it tap it in just like that like so so you know same thing on the other side just rotate them forward rotate them forward and then they will pack in same as that one like that and then they will pack in on this middle section here and you just come on pack come on get 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 inside come on you know just be careful just try to pack this section without unpacking the other side anyway. there you go There's, there you go the section is up now come on stay down there there you go then what you gonna do, then you got, you know, basically like that, the configuration. Almost done! So, then what you gonna do, you wanna take this foot here, the shin, you bend at the knee all the way around until it wraps around your, you know, your legs. Just fold it up, just like that. And you just can't unpack, I don't know why. There you go. And then what you gonna do, um, if you see um, here, if you see here, they got uh, two um, simple port, 
port right here. Picks right here. No, no uh, simple hole on this back here. And get uh, take out some picks on the foot here. You just want to take these two picks and packs onto these two holes. Just like that. And make sure you line this up right. Because you don't like to line this up right. And now he don't do but He usually does but See? Now he come unpack ah. Get 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 Join you together man ah. Now he come undone There you go So you basically um To try to pack them If you can Which now it give me problem There you go there you go, yeah, and make sure everything um, lines up, right? Sorry for the off camera a little bit there, but anyway, there you go. There you have um, um, four Cybertron Optimus in his Cybertronian truck mode. That's what they call it. And you do roll very well. It just not every view roll. I don't know why. You do roll very well. There we go. So. I think that one did not roll out on why. There you go. And he rolls very good, you know, he got six wheels there, so it's actually, you know, he should roll. And you take the gun, basically, this port is for the vehicle mod, and just either these two holes, there's no option, you just either you plug in here, either you plug in here. It's up to you. But I personally, I'm looking here. That. So, very, very cool. It's, it's, you know, it's a very, very nice art mode. I mean, you got some paint apps, you know, got some nice silver, de silver paint here. That's all you get. And the rims actually very nice. It's very cool. And, you know, this vehicle mode, a lot of people complain. It's very small, and yeah. Here's where we start from Joe. You can see, truck is smaller than a car. A normal earth mode car. How predictable. But anyway. You know, Hasbro is going to El Cheapo with their figure, so that's, that's why they have this small. But but overall, I I as I said, I don't mind the size of it. It just I just mind the you know the the beautiful of it and and this figure do you know it just do it for me. I I don't care about the size. I mean you know this figure is still do it for me. So. Would I recommend it? Of course I will and um, there, you know, this truck is a bit smaller than the previous version of the War for Cybertron and yeah, but I don't have it, but sorry, but very nice video. I really, really like it and people, you know, this kind of like fold up prime, you know, this, because the vehicle was like so small, I mean, seriously. So, that basically it so yeah there you go there is the um transformer generations the fourth cybertron deluxe class um optimus prime so very nice and um yeah yeah very cool and i will definitely recommend it if you like the game, so yeah, very nice figure. Thumbs up. So, so if you like this video, click the thumbs up icon down below, and yeah, thanks for watching.